I've been volunteering for about five years, and I started because I was convicted by the Lord to get up at, out of the chair and start teaching. I had been fed long enough, and it was time for me to feed somebody else, and I chose the preschool children. The Sunday school ministry for the preschool department is the children coming in, moms and dads dropping off the preschoolers, and basically, we just have fun. We have an agenda, we have a truth, we have a principle, and we have a story. We get that story told in a very enthusiastic and motivated way, right on their level with language that they understand. And we just center the whole morning's activities around us, be it songs or Bible verse activities, even the snacks. My husband and I began helping in the children's ministry back when our children were young. We wanted to teach them and their friends, and now we teach our grandchildren and their friends. Our second graders not only hear the Bible story, but they enjoy finding it in the Bible, and they take turns reading the verses. My faith grows as I see God working in the lives of these precious children. By the end of the year, they know so much more about the Bible. They're not intimidated. They like to sing, they like the stories. Sometimes we use puppets to tell the stories. We have videos and they get it because I don't tell a story that I always follow up with questions, but they get it because they're answering without me prompting. And if we can continue to get these children from six weeks on faithfully every Sunday, their mommies and daddies are being fed in Sunday school classes. They know the children are in a safe place and that their kids are being fed and then they can come back, pick up their child, know what the truth is that they were taught that Sunday morning and continue that conversation at home, in the car. We're gonna raise up the next generation. I believe it's important for our church to reach out to families in our community to help them with their needs. If we teach them about God's love, then hopefully they will teach their children and their children's children.